Hello, my name is John Michael O'Brien and I'm an Inside Application Engineer with Agilent Technologies. Uh, today what I'm going to show you is how to use the VisaCom libraries to talk with an instrument. Uh, the VisaCom libraries are especially well suited for working with languages like VB, VB.NET, C Sharp, F Sharp, uh, basically anything that works on the .NET framework or works well with COM objects. Um, today we're going to be talking with an MSOX 90,000 family scope, uh, one of the newest scopes in that family. And you can see that here in the Agilent Connection Expert. So to start off, what we'll want to do is we'll op want to open up a copy of Visual Basic here in Excel, which will give us access to VBA. From there, we're going to need to add references to the Visa libraries. You'll notice well, I've already checked it here. We've got the VisaCom 3.0 type library and the VisaCom 48.2 formatted I.O. library. VisaCom is the, the core objects that will actually let us talk with the instrument, and the VisaCom 48.2 formatted I.O. library will give us a lot of additional tools to simplify communication. So we're going to go ahead and start a new subroutine. And basically, uh, we're going to go through a few basic steps. The first one is we need to get a handle to the resource manager, which will let us find the individual resources available, like our, our oscilloscope. Then we're going to need to create a, a session handle, where we actually get a connection to the instrument. And then lastly, we're going to want to use the formatted I.O. tools to actually talk with the instrument and get our results. So we're going to start out by defining a, a resource manager to work with. Resource manager, there we go. And then we'll define a session as Visa Session. It's actually iVisa Session because it's an interface Visa Session. And then we're also going to create an object we're going to call in inst to represent instrument, but it's actually a formatted IO48 object. So first we'll set our resource manager equal to a new instance of the resource manager. This will automatically create a handle to the default resource manager. Second, we're going to set our session equal to and then we're going to ask our resource manager to open a connection to, and then we need the visa address of our device. You can get that straight here from the Agile and I.O. library suite. We just select the instrument, select visa address, punch that in there. Next, we're going to want to create a new formatted I.O. tool. So we'll create set inst equal to new formatted I.O. And then lastly, we have to set the inst.io object equal to our session. Basically, the I.O. member is what set Visa session we want to write to. Once we've done that, we then tell the uh, inst object that we want to write a string. We're going to write the IDN string that we can pull from the programmer's reference for the oscilloscope. Then we're going to want uh, Excel to give us a message box with the return value of that. So we do an inst and then a read string which will pull back the result from the instrument. Once, once we've done that, it'll show us the IDN string for our scope. From there, we then want to set the instrument I.O. object equal to nothing, so we can clean it up properly. We'll uh, ask the session to close. Then we'll set the instrument itself to nothing. And lastly, set the resource manager to nothing. This will fully clean up all of our resources. Oh, one more. We need to set the session equal to nothing as well. <laughs> This last bit here will clean up all of our session resources and free up all of the records that we're actually using and make sure that we don't have any lingering memory leaks and things of that nature. If we run the program real fast, we get back a dialog box here. You can see it shows the Agile Technologies MSOX 3204A oscilloscope and gives us back our serial number and uh, firmware revision. Thanks a lot for watching. Uh, if you have any questions, please feel free to call us here at the call center. You, we can be reached by calling 1-800-829-4444. Thanks a lot and have a great day.